Have you been wondering what light, medium and heavy equip loads do in Elden Ring? Well, let's test out and start with sprinting. All hitting the wall at the exact same time. Here it is again at half speed. This test takes into account both acceleration and top speed as I hit the sprint button from a jog at the same point each time. Okay, now what you probably care about more is rolling. As you can tell here, heavy rolling is clearly slower, but there's actually no difference between light and medium, which is weird. Uh, in case you don't know, you need under 30% equip burden to have a light equipment load, uh, 30 to 70% for medium, 70 to 100 for heavy, and if you go over 100%, you can still move around, but you can't roll at all, which obviously in a game like this would be terrible, so don't do that. Um, but what's the benefit of having light over medium now? So now we're going to measure um, a chain of 10 rolls to try and work out how long it takes to do each one. Once again, seems to be no difference between light and medium. However, I hypothesize that the light equip burden gives you more invincibility frames. In case you don't know, in all of the um, From Software games, I think, um, you get invincibility frames when you roll or dodge, um, which gives you, it varies from like a quarter of a second to half a second, depending on the game, of like a period of invincibility. So you can literally roll through attacks. Um, and in my fight with Margit here, I really struggled when I was at medium equipment load until I took half my armor off, and obviously, look a bit ridiculous. Um, even though I take more damage when I do get hit, I survived much, much better in a fight like this, where I could dodge out the way of all of his attacks. It's probably going to take more research, and I'll make a follow-up video later. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you again soon.